Some of the rides at Kings Island can be scary, but your scariest ride may be just trying to get to the park. Thousands of people jammed Kings Island today. But an analysis by WCPO.com shows an intersection next to the park is among the worst in Butler and Warren counties. Nine on your side, Butler and Warren County reporter Jay Warren is at that intersection with a story you'll see only on Nine on Your Side. Jay? Well, Clyde and Carol, you can see the intersection behind me. A lot of this traffic once again headed to Kings Island. There were 11 crashes here last year, a lot more crashes in and around this intersection. But as you're about to find out, there were intersections with even more. The hearts are pumping once again at Kings Island Amusement Park as the roller coasters take people on a wild ride. But here at the intersection of Kings Island Drive and Western Row Road, things can also get a little hairy. You got to be on your well, on the lookout for sure. That's because fast moving traffic coming off I-71 North can run into a backup. You come to immediate stop. You think it you're, you're coming off the highway, you're coming at a good clip, and then you just come to a dead stop. With Kings Island opening today, shuttle bus driver Monica Coleman says she's already seen some accidents. Saw maybe two fender benders from where we're standing now. Already today. Already today, this morning. This intersection in Liberty Township has seen its fair share of accidents last year. The intersection of Cincinnati Dayton and Yankee Roads tops the list of most dangerous intersections in Butler and Warren County in WCPO study. I was not surprised. Our son, about a year ago, was in an accident at that very intersection and totaled a car that he had just purchased. The top crash locations last year, as determined by WCPO, are Cincinnati, Dayton, and Yankee with 19 accidents, US 22 and State Route 48 with 18, Mason, Montgomery, and Socialville Foster with 16, and then at 11, Western Row and Kings Island Drive with 11. Universally, engineers in this area cite the rapid population growth as a reason for the increased volume of cars. As for Coleman, she has this advice for those driving to Kings Island. Take your time. It's not going anywhere. The, the rides will be here. I know it's weather's gorgeous outside. Everyone's excited to get here, but just take your time and have some patience. Now, our colleagues at WCPO.com, Taylor Murfendereski and Mark Nichols, they were the ones who crunched these numbers. The traffic engineers are aware, of course, of these intersections, and the one in Liberty Township and this one, they are both scheduled for some major renovation in the coming years. Jay Warren, not on your side, Mason. All right, Jay, thanks. Here's another question. Are any of these dangerous intersections in your neighborhood? Well, you can read much more and see the entire list right now on WCPO.com.